My first guest tonight is in a new show called Chicago Code, which I think is uh, a show that takes place in Chicago. <laughs> It's on Mondays on the Fox Network. Take a look at this. You know, a police officer is dead. So your life's just got put in a vice. The city is in lockdown. One strike and you're out. So you spit on the sidewalk, you roll a joint, you got a hair out of place, I don't care, you were spending the night in a lockup. The sooner you help us solve this, the sooner hell goes away. Till then, welcome to Zero Tolerance. Huh? Where are you going, Jack? Hold it. Don't you just go. Please welcome Jennifer Beals, everybody. Jennifer, Jennifer Beals. Look at you. I have to say, Jennifer, lovely as it is to see you, and it is, and you do look absolutely charming and gorgeous and sexy, and I like this metal thing going on here. <laughs> I'm surprised to see you uh, uh, hit somebody, because I think of you as being a rather kind of shy person. I am, I am a shy person, but I did grow up with brothers, so... I you see. know, I have acquired a few skills. Did, did you actually hit your brothers, then? Is that what you're saying? Because CBS well, in no way endorses that kind of behavior. <laughs> I did um, actually hit a... I don't even know if I should say this. Oh, you should. No one watches this show. You'll be fine. <laughs> ah. I did actually hit a boyfriend with a camera once. That's yeah. okay. He was very badly behaved, I have to say. But it was on a, a, a train station in Morocco, which maybe was not the best. Wait, this is a great story. <laughs> so, first of all, you've got this boyfriend and you, uh, he's taking pictures of you. Oh, no. <laughs> then what's the camera for? It's my camera to, oh, you know, document the trip and all. Oh, uh, in Morocco? Yes. Right, and where were you in Morocco? Oh, Mar Mar Marrakesh, Casablanca. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of French people up and down there. Oui, you know oui, that? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you speak French? Uh, pas bien. No. Pas bien. No, right. Tu peux essayer, si tu veux. Oh, yeah, see, you got me right there. <laughs> There's a couple of people, a girl from the valley would probably help you out, though she speaks. Um, do you know if I had a nickel for every time I'd said that sentence, there's a girl from the valley. Now, listen, tell me about the Chicago Code, then. Do you play a tough cop I'm who... I'm sorry, I'm very distracted by this. This is fantastic. Do you know, well, I was, you I was bitten anything, by a rattlesnake. Touch it again if you want. There you go. Oh, you know how to hold it. Yeah, I do. Yeah. I do. Okay. Yeah. That's right, yeah, nice. just nice. cup underneath, there you are. <laughs> now, are you fond of snakes? I am, actually, I am fond of snakes. Really? I was bitten by a rattlesnake, though. Shut the hell up! I was. You were bit by a snake? Yes, I was. Recently? Mm, a while ago, but on my foot, on my foot, and it was like you being stabbed by two safety pins. Uh, are you all right? Yeah, what kind I'm, of a snake I'm, was it? I'm fine. It was, I don't know which kind of rattlesnake it was. It was a rattlesnake? Yes, it well, was a rattlesnake. Well, why didn't you avoid it when you heard the rattling? Well, because it was a baby, and so the rattle's very quiet. Oh, so you just kind of like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah did exactly. you get sick? Uh, I did, actually. Well, first I had the swelling, and I, I took some Arnica, which is this homeopathic medicine for the swelling, and that went away. Right. And then uh, my husband and I were driving in the car, and I felt myself outside of the car watching myself and I was realizing that I wasn't breathing and I didn't need to breathe what? and it was very strange. Ooh, this so is I, acid you're talking I, yeah. about now. <laughs> And so I, I said, I think I need to go to the hospital. So we went to the hospital where they did nothing. It was amazing. <laughs> How much did they charge you for that <laughs> yeah, nothing? Exactly. Wow! Yeah. So, and you, well, you were you had an out of body experience from a rattlesnake. I did. It was not unpleasant. I have to say, it was not unpleasant. CBS cares. <laughs> That's, I, I, so I can imagine then snakes. So I'll put this out of the way then. Are you, okay. are you, are you frightened by snakes? No, though? no, not at all. No. Well, do you like snakes? Yeah, though? I do. I do like snakes. Do you have any snakes? I don't. I don't. But I, I do like them. Oh, really? I you do. like them, but not enough to have one. No, but I like to pet them, and actually their tongues are very soft. I don't know if you know that. <laughs> In your pants. Hey. Man. Jeez. 
So tell me about the Chicago golf then. You play it. Okay. Yo, you, do, do you make it in Chicago? That looked a bit yes. like Chicago yes, there. Yes, yes, it's completely Are you from Chicago? Yes, I am. No way! Yes. I didn't know they had rattlesnakes in Chicago. No, I didn't get bitten in oh, Chicago. Right. No, right. Well, what kind of snakes do they have in Chicago? Oh, political. Oh. <laughs> what part of Chicago are you from? Well, I, I both the north side and the south side. So it's both Cubs and Sox. So you're kind of family. bi curious. Yes. And <laughs> Do you know, have you ever met Oprah? I have actually. Really? Yeah. She's, what does she smell like? Um, quite lovely, like um, baby powdery. I suspected, yeah, I suspected like not cologne, not kind of, oh no, no like no, too no. much, like oh here comes Oprah. But, uh, <laughs> I suspect some kind of like wealthy, classy kind of smell. Yeah. Like friendly, like a friendly smell. Really? Like kind of yeah. baked cookies? No, like 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 um the sweetness of babies kind of the smell. The sweetness of babies? Yeah. I've got a ten day old baby in the house right now. <laughs> he doesn't smell that good at all. The head, the top of the head smells good, yeah. Oh, the, but you know, you have to fight through a lot of different aromas to get to the top of the head. Do you? Uh, you've got, you've got a child, haven't you? Yes, I do. Your daughter? Yes. What I age do. is she? She's five. Five. Oh, he's year past all that now. Yeah, yeah. No. Yeah. She's now sleeping, but she didn't, you know, sleep a lot when she was. Well, they yeah. don't. They don't. They're not interested. And they're, there's no reasoning with them at all. No, I know. Last night I was saying to him, you know, this is getting us nowhere. He's like, ah. This isn't a debate. This isn't even a, a, a discussion. <laughs> oh, <sighs> I feel your pain. It's, but it's, but are you going to have more? Well, I, I would love to if God is willing to give a surprise. That would be nice. But well, you, you got to have sex. Well, yeah. You can't just hang around waiting. I mean, yeah. God, of course, will help you, but you have to well, participate. Trying, I mean, really. I'm trying to very gently say that I'm a little long in the tooth, maybe, to have another. No, no, yeah. What, are you, so. like, 31? You're fine. Yeah, 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 I'm 31. Well, there you are. Hey, have you ever um, uh, posted uh, topless pictures of yourself on the Internet? Always, every day. Really? Yeah. No, I would never do Would you ever do that? No, 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 no never in no. a million years. Would you I can barely get out of the house, much no. less, you know. I, what I think is, I just don't, have you ever been on any of these Craigslist? things or anything like that. I've never, no. no. Exactly. Never bought anything from the internet? Uh, you know, Amazon, like a book or something. Right, yeah. No, oh, I've no, no, I did buy a few Buffy the Vampire Slayer, like, magnets. <laughs> I did. Why did you need them? I had a little crush on Spike, so I just wanted to have my own personal I magnet. never watched Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Oh, it's really Was good. It good? I, I mean, do you watch the new vampires? The, you know, the kind of twinky gay vampire? <laughs> Once you, you know, have a child, it's not yeah, no. a lot of... But, you see, my, you know, I've got this certain rules about vampires. They can be gay or straight. i got no problem with that. But it's, it's more kind of... A, I quite like them to suck blood. You know what I mean? It's <laughs> not just care about your feelings. I mean, that's, that's not a vampire. That's just a gay friend. You know, it's... <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's just me. I'm not getting enough sleep. I'm very cranky. I'm that's all right. Yeah. That's all right. We're out of time. Uh, awkward pause or mouth organ? Mouth organ. Good. <laughs> Do you play? Because, you know, surprisingly, a, a, a very small amount of people actually play the mouth organ. And if you can play the mouth organ, you win the coveted gold mouth organ that we give no, away here. I, I, I don't know how to play a mouth organ, but I'm, I'm happy to try. Well, Do you know how to play? No. Let's go. <laughs> Can you go then? Oh, I can do this too? Yeah, yeah, well, you, you didn't just... even unwrap it for me. What well, I'll unwrap it for you? you if you want. Yeah, thanks. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I usually, uh, you know, I'm a bit nervous. All right. There you are, it's unwrapped and okay, uh, okay. never been touched. Hmm. Okay, can I ask a really silly question? Sure. Which side? <laughs> Feel your way. That's pretty good for a first timer. Thanks. All right, knock it off. <laughs>